All right, so here we are at the studio, and I actually share a space with a company called Lucky, Lucky Branded Entertainment. Great guys, very creative, uh, a cutting edge agency. And what we're gonna do today is I'm gonna show you, in this episode, a lighting technique that I use. We're actually shooting a fashion shoot for Lucy Friend for her unique silk tops. So, let me show you what we're gonna do. So here we are, that's our set, coming on into the studio. The models are actually getting their makeup done at the moment, and their makeup is happening right over there. And that is Milana in the chair, and that's Patrick. And here we have the camera set up back here, and you can see our set. So let me go over the lighting situation with you. What we're doing is we're shooting on a white seamless, okay, to give us a very clean background. And if you notice there on the right side, that is a large shamir. It's a soft bank. And effectively what that's doing is it's creating a very nice, beautiful light with soft shadows. And the disc here on the left hand side is our fill card. And what that's doing is it's bouncing light back onto our model who will be standing here on this blue X. And we got our security guard sitting there, make sure that no one moves the X, right? So we have the fill card. And the fill card bounces the light back on the model just to soften the shadows just a little bit more so it gives her a nice beautiful light. Here's an example of using a fill card. So in this first shot you'll notice that the left side of her face is nice soft shadows. Depending on where you place your fill card determines on how deep the shadows will go. Now here is coming up the second shot. Boom. Notice how the shadows deepened. This is with no fill card at all. Now, what I'm doing to light the background is I'm using two bare heads, okay? And the heads aren't pointing directly at the background. What I'm doing is I'm feathering the lights to either side of the background. So they're not pointing, like I said, to directly to the background. I have this, this light on the right side. It's pointing to the left side of the background. And the left light is pointing to the right side. So they're crossing over and they're going to give us a nice even light, making sure that we get a clean white surface, okay? Now, here we have, on this light, this is actually cinefoil. Because like I said, this is a bare head, so it's, it's casting out a very wide uh, area of light. So what the cinefoil does is it actually blocks any spill light that would come and hit the model. Because these, these heads are actually putting out a lot of light, and it's too bright to hit the model. So what these, like I said, what this uh, cinefoil is doing is blocking the light from spilling onto our model, keeping the light from our soft bank. That's our key light that keeps the model nice and beautiful. That is our basic setup for today. Uh, that's part of the lighting tutorial that I was uh, getting hounded by everybody to come up with something to show you. And I'm glad that you joined us today. You can follow me on Facebook at Spencer Gordon Studios, or you can follow me on Twitter, Flash SG. And if you have any questions, feel free to email me, Spencer at SpencerGordon.com. Thanks again for watching. I really appreciate it. Thank you.